Welcome to Life is Strange once again. But this time, episode 3. I've been really looking forward to this because all it did last time was give me more questions than answers. You know? So, let's, let's get this started. Come on. Okay. Excited. I'm really giddy. I really want to play this. I want to see how it unfolds. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange. Whoa! They called film Little Pieces of Time. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. You're my business now. That's and Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. <laughs> What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Well, that's that. We're back in schedule, or at least I don't think I used the right words, but whatever. I was never good with English, anyway. Okay. Why do they have to put the thing again there? I know who I I bought I, I got this episode so you know I know who, who made this you know okay I'm saying you know a lot again already know unless this like episode is gonna be like something huge Episode 3, Chaos Theory. Does she always have a... a rabbit? Oh. Kate! Oh. Something to show you, meet me in front of campus. campus. I knew Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Goodbye, Mr. Wabbit. Alright. Nobody messes with the me bitch. Can I clean it? No way can I clean that shit off. Time to get Samuel da Vinci to repaint. Hmm. Um, we should check, actually. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... Oh. Flashlight. Actually, hold on. Let me get... Let me check if the... The plant. The plant. I forgot about the plant. Hold on. Almost in every part has it been... Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. Oh. 
There's been so much going on, I almost forgot about the eclipse. All this atmospheric action can't be a coincidence. And all roads are leading to my tornado vision. Hey, Bunny. Hmm. Kate will be back soon, and until then, I'll be catering to your every whim. I'll give you some food. Are you hungry, Bunny? Here, nosh on this. Nosh? Is that a neat word for a feed? Um, mirror, bed, anything in a drawer? It's amazing how oh. happy Kate looks here compared weird. to today. She was basically pushed up to that roof, and I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. Boop. Um, looks like that's it. Alright. Adventure. Someone... Oh, no, someone left. Actually, why is the restroom open? Oh, why are you up? Hello, Taylor. Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. Let's be nice. I can. I'm just so glad she didn't. Are you okay? I'm just like shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Mm. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Uh, where did she go? Where did she go? I know I can trust you since you were so nice asking about my mom in the hospital, yes. but Victoria will like make my life hell if I blab, okay? No doubt. I do hope your mother gets better. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. Yeah. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Mm -hmm. Uh, oh. Um, there you go. Forgot I could do that. How do I, uh, make that fat? Oh, shift. Uh, but. Alright. Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and see um, Kate. That's I can't weird. believe she tried to jump. My space button is not working. Uh. I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Yeah. Oh man, like, you saw her? She was so, like, nervous when she left the dorm. She wouldn't even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Ooh. Well, I have to go crash. <laughs> it's been a rough day, as you know. Thanks, Max. And it was, like, pretty awesome when you went up to the roof to save Kate. Victoria was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. All right, we're back. Victoria isn't oh, here. Maybe I'll just oh, wait right and bide my time. Going, on going through her shit. Victoria isn't here. Oh, I just Maybe needed the fix. The space bar that was strangely not working. All right, be yeah. right back. Let's uh, check her room now. Ooh, spooky, scary. Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detect, these socks cost more than my wardrobe. Eh, yeah, those aren't important. Search. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Hmm. Interesting. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Alright. A laptop. Well, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. This is like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes. Fuck. Trash can? 
That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Damn. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Oh. Oh yeah, look. There's an action figure. Is that her? Self-centered. First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. Bag. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Um... Victoria is about as straight as me. <sighs> Nothing to see here. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. Alright. Uh, where else can one acquire secrets? This place. Oh, she seems down. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. Uh, we're all responsible. I think we're all responsible for what happened. True. But you're the only one who went up to that roof with Kate. Oh, where was everyone? Seriously? That was bullshit. Where was everybody else? I know. You're a better person than any of us here. Hey, Max. I think I need to crash now. I'm just over everything today. Alright, I'll leave you alone. Um, to the outside. Fireflies. So Chloe is waiting for me oh. in front of the main hall. Uh, main hall. Oh. Ah, gotcha. Principal ah, Wells. Oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Can I talk to him? That smart son of a bitch has me trapped. Blackwell almost lost another student. Wish Kate Marsh would just skip town. Now I have to deal with more pissed off entitled parents who want to blame me for their mistakes. Cheers. Asshole. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Max the Ninja strikes again. Gotcha. Hell yeah. Ah, fuck it. I'm sitting my ass down. <laughs> I'm sitting my ass. That sounds like an old man. Um, there's some Max. Right. Nobody can. Uh, parking, dormitories, main building. I'm guessing. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Uh, do Booyah! Oh, Get it? <laughs> Booyah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. Bitch. More like a scary punk asshole. That actually got me. Well, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry. Uh. That you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Mm. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing. And your badass power is going to save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. Mm-hmm. Hmm. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? 
I don't even know how to f chaos theory. Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Yeah. Oh, right. Except for your ability to, oh, yeah, manipulate time and space. No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even Shit. torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? I didn't actually think he got expelled. Um... Rachel seems important. We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. <sighs> she was able to blend in with everybody. Even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Hmm. Kicking it? Alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Mm -hmm. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Alright. So we're gonna sneak into Blackwell Academy. Thank you again so much for helping me put together fuck. a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. Mm -hmm. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give uh. you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick Whoa. to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you uh... think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Hmm... Are you fucking kidding me? So... Does this mean they're having relations? Or is she just fucking around? I don't understand. So stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Mm -hmm. Let's go find out. Uh, shit, we're gonna go talk to him. Oh, no, we're going inside. That's... That... that mm, I don't know if they're both at fault. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. It's pretty dark. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. 
<sighs> okay, okay, I'll play your game. I'll play your little game. Uh, uh, let's see. Trendy hat. I feel bad for the twee hipster who lost this beret. Betty's cute. <laughs> oh. Oh. There it is. Squirrels like nuts. Does that mean Samuel is. Nah. Hmm. Mm -mm. Does that signify that he's crazy? Or was that just smart? Nah. I'll just stop questioning. There's no way David would get in Mrs. Grant's face. She'd shut his ass down fast. Hmm. Okay. Not gonna take the time to read that. Because I hate reading. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. Why, yes, I could. Hmm, yeah. I guess I can decide the. Oh, uh, no, no. Nothing here. File. Dead end. Files. Files. Boring. And file. Crap. Oh, what about the key rack? Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. Shit. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank, but I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Ah, uh, figures. Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would say open a locked door would you maybe kind of know how huh no i'm just asking for fun thanks <laughs> science guy uh, no 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 stay we need you as backup just send the text instructions now yes i'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in thanks for the hope Damn door. What Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Lupin? I don't get it. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. I think it's not that one. Is it this one? Yeah, no. This is like a scene in a horror film. Let's have a look. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? I don't get it. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. Ooh. I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work, but he does have some style. Oh, graveyard. It's like he hid that one. Cigarettes. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Ooh, we can have a look at his computer. No, we can't. Duct 
tape. Let's take that. The tape is mine. Only three more items to go. Oh, I need items? I wasn't even aware. Uh, give me a moment. This game is a bit loud. There you go. Alright, um... This is a science class, alright. Science book. Sugar. Spice. Ooh, sugar. And everything nice. Alright. You're halfway home, Matt. Only a B minus? Warren has shattered my faith. Of course, I'm barely passing science. Keyword is try. I bowed to your wisdom. He said that would blow up. Max, so here. I didn't blow up. Not yet. I need to concentrate. TTYL. Uh, ah, there it is. Tape. Sugar. Oh. NaCO3. And is that a lighter? Alright. Definitely creepy. Oh. Hello again, science lab. I had to come back because I need chemicals. Chemicals. Um, a Bunsen burner. Chemicals. Periodic table. Graffiti. Aquarium. We should look at chemistry stuff. I might find the acid in there. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Okay, so it's not in there. Science book. Fuck it. Let's take a look in the science book. So sodium chlorate is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Ah, and what did we see up there? Here's the sodium chlorate box. You're an artist, damn it, not oh. a scientist. But this is so not sodium. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Man, rewind power chair. Only one more ingredient left. I don't know what that is. Empty. Come on. Damn it. Uh, this one. Nothing here. No one throws trash away anymore. Nope. Doesn't anybody drink sodas here? Bathroom? A long time ago, Nathan got smacked down. Nothing in it. Uh, you didn't even reach your hand. Oh. Please, trash can. What do you know? Trash. <laughs> Don't be a smart ass with me. Not now. Just emptied. Nothing here. Ah, uh, come on. There's got to be something. Oh, trash. Nothing. Search. This is so lame. Uh. Finding a soda can at school should not be an epic quest. Or fail. Like, in a vending machine. Maybe? It's I nothing. probably should find those items now. Hello, vending machine. Release the crack hand. 
Oh. Are you for real? It's all mine anyway. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. She starts an open it yet. Hi. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Um. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get oh, ready God. to haul ass. I really hope there's no one. Oh fuck. That was so fucking cool. Oh, we are toast. Uh oh. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? Fucking find the key. Um. Wait. If I can rewind it to where I'm already on the other side of the door. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with her rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. Hello. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money. But no taste. Do we really want- How can you trust somebody oh. who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. It's not that bad. I would like a desk like that. I would feel fancy. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock? Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. Alright. I'd probably be behind a desk, if anything. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. Uh, search. And nothing here. Fuck. Ooh, these cabinets look important. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. Bad Chloe. Only two more files to go. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Like I'm not gonna read my own personal file. <laughs> This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Let's okay. nab this last file, Sherlock. Always wanted to say nab. Tumbleweeds. Well, she has said nab before. Look what? at this pile. Oh. When I fed the little bunny. That's all. It's kind of dark. I certainly can't use this. Ooh, and recently. This pretty much oh. sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Alright. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Max, you better come check out these files. Ooh. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus. And my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Oh. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? 
At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open oh, it. Oh, it's suspension. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. What? That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. Mm. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. Who's David M.? It's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Yeah. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers <laughs> of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy Whoa. shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This'll chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Yes. Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? Yes. I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Uh, leave it. Fuck it. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but... I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. Dude, this is for But yes, Moral Max is right again. Handicapped. I guess. You were, Let's get the hell out of this office. That was just morally more. wrong. <laughs> I am not that, I'm not that much of a hard ass. To have I know that money that. helped Chloe and me. Oof. Can't really turn off the monitor, so just go ahead and. That impish look scares me. Yeah. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish splash. splish. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. The fuck? God damn it. Um, I guess we gotta go with Splish Splash. Yeah, I didn't even know the school had a pool. Weird way of opening the door. We're in the otter's oh, the doors. Oh. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. Yeah. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls' night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Alright. What do you got? Boys nice or girls? Stuff. Oh. Um. Speak evil. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Can I just rewind? What would happen if they say girls? Would she say I'm boring or ah fuck? Girls? Girls, of course. Girls. Ooh la la. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Oh, I don't think it fucking matters. Okay, let's be proper. It's a sock. Where does that other sock go? I left our locker open. Those are some musty ass old shirts. Yuck. Towelettes. Uh, I'll just 
follow. Ooh. Oh, I thought it was some weird thing. Ooh, let's see what's inside her. So, locker. Victoria's uh, secret is selfies. Go fuck your. No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. <sighs> what does she have to have talent? Whoa. Otters eat beers. I give less of a shit. Victoria Chase Rose. I could give less of a shit. Hello. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. What do you mean sharks? I don't un I, I don't understand. Um light. Light. Uh, light. There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. There it is. Lights. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's cute. Did she just steal that? Okay. Thought she had white hair for a moment. Now what? Time to do or dive, Max. But. 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 Oh. Oh yeah, baby. Feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. I ain't no hippie. I kill you. Cowabunga! Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark the shows. The water looks like jello. <laughs> Are they standing? Yeah, it's not even that deep. I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. Dude, I haven't swam in a pool in like forever. I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related, and I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, Aww. girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like this force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. She's got a point. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. I also have a point. For what reason? Yeah. You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Um, I guess that's not, not with that a time. Positive. But that's because you were there to kickstart my power. So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected, since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Got a point. Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More th than Rachel Amber? Hey. Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Uh. <laughs> Warren is nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. Got his ass beat. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Uh, that, that... Now that. I'm getting cold in here. 
gave me foreshadowing Because events. we're yapping instead of attacking each other, otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's jet. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. That was heated water. Interesting. Alright, finally I feel leave. like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. <laughs> you would know. Oh, fuck! Uh-oh. Fuck. Shit. Move, Shit. Max! Don't waste your power on getting busted! Shit. We gotta get out. Let's go. Make sure you cover the whole Are you shitting me? Oh fuck. There are multiple cops. Dude, hide! Like when we were kids. I could use my power. Or just look for a hiding spot. Or both. Where are well. they? Hey! Okay. I can't use that too much. Where are they? Uh Hello? Boy. Okay. Okay, this is what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh he Hello? checks Anybody the stalls, there? no? No, he doesn't. I could have hidden the stalls. Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Hey! Fuck. I'm a stick. Okay, don't turn the corner. Oh, looks like he's out. Hmm. gonna come back in are we good to go oh it's dark in here hmm it looks like we're safe Can't still be checking around, are they? Oh. We are so invisible. Fail. <laughs> That would have sucked if we had those security cameras around. Wait! Turn around! Balls. They're coming! We have to find another way out! Oh, this is bullshit! You can't go back to your dorm now, you're a Blackwell fugitive! Crash at my place tonight! You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? Uh, okay! Into the car! Uh... Get in!
God, you didn't have to yell. You did not have to yell. That was so unnecessary. Hold on. Uh, all right, they would be at school, wouldn't they? Hmm. Okay. Uh, I still didn't get a lot of my answers. You know? Still have questions that need to be answered. Do you not have school? Uh, she's probably gonna wake up being like, oh shit, I overslept. Am I right? Uh, gives no shit. Always remember this moment. Selfie. Photo bomb. Ah. Photo hog. The fuck? How do you have that much energy? It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Mm. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch, Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. Uh. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. I wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Mm -hmm. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. I know that it is freezing. No, the copyright music. Oh, well. Waving at the taxis, they keep turning their lights on. Okay, I need to get dressed now. Where the fuck did you put the clothes? Oh, Warren. Please, I just want to. Oh. See, you didn't blow up Blackwell last night. Almost glad. <laughs> By the way, the driving is actually popular, so I'm buying the ticks now. I'll let you take care of the popcorn. In other words, you can't back out now. Alright. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. Uh. Huh. Oh, okay, she's talking about the Kate thing. Hmm. You know, come for your ass. I know where you sleep. Hey, whore. Feminazi. Feminazi? Will be exterminated. Watch out. Oh. Man, if I had stayed hidden, David wouldn't be targeting me. Well, it happened. Wow. I remember this old phone. We decorated it together. Hmm, it's probably on the floor somewhere. Oh, no, it's nicely folded. Well, it's the jacket is. Ugh, no, it still no, it's not. reeks like a chlorine factory. Thought it was folded. I was wrong. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. Yeah. Okay, time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. How convenient. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second-guessing yourself, Max. 
put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. Whoa. Uh. Uh. Mm, this. I don't want to. No. No. Sorry, not that easy. Oh, like I am? Just admit that you already macked on me, then used your rewind. Now I can text Warren that you're saving yourself all for him. I am so going to best unfriend you for that. What the fuck? I love that Chloe is so fearless. Oh! Oh, no! Oh, no. I'm curious. Nah. Shit, it's ripped. Looking and sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for Jesus. the mosh pit, Shaka Bra. Uh, Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to uh, wake and bake first. Wake and bake? I promise not to tell. Uh oh. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? The hell, this thing is. I mean, the shirt doesn't need a rip. Okay, uh, wallet. Right, let's go. Mm. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Oh. Oh. Hello, Miss Miss Lady Joyce. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Ah, uh, uh, I mean Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Her? Um, eggs and bacon. I'm not a eggs and bacon person. all the way. Remember when you guys would sleep in until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. We'd wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. Uh -huh. I need you to grab me the actual eggs and the bacon. So everything. I can handle eggs and bacon. Uh, eggs and bacon. What was that? I should evolve and become a vegan, but... Huh, <sighs> bacon. Like, for real? What the fuck? Uh... Eh, uh, where'd you keep eggs? Eh, uh, eh. Uh. Newspaper, bottle, cereal. Oh, what is that? Oh. That was like a video game thing. I've been like, <gasps> vid games. Um. Again. Uh. Travel money. <laughs> It's really not in here. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. What the hell would you... Let me ask. Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. Uh, you're not very specific. Where would you keep eggs? Where else would an egg be? Um... Oh, what? Jeez, can you help me get this bird out of here? The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. She... Okay, she left the eggs here. That was weird. Bird? Bird? Oh! Bird. Bird, hey. be gone! Fly, you fool! Um. Should probably open a door. You know? I just let it fly around. Or not. How'd the bird get in here? Hmm. Oh, window, window. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Alright, alright. Get, get, get out of here. You little bitch. 
wonder if he would have just smacked the window if I hadn't done that. That would be pretty funny. Definitely really funny. Alright. Um. Uh, here you go. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. Mm. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce. But we are on the same page, Max. Uh. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Mm. Yeah. Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. But Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. I'm grounded? Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Oh. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than it me. It sounds like she was. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila. A breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> Go sit at the table. Yeah. Oh god, I'm afraid he's just gonna come out of nowhere and be like, Hey, what you doing here? Little bitch. Oh man. I don't want to be famous for this. Ugh. Um, peanut butter. Oh. oh. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. Eh. Should have not said that. Whatever. Just eating eggs. Um, you left that baking strip. Finish Bring it. Bring those eggs and bake into my belly. Um. Oh. Oh, that's her. Um. Let's have a look at that. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Out of peanut butter. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Seeing you again. Ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. <laughs> My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. I want to see those pictures wow, too. I totally remember that day. Wow. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this and, and Oh, let's not talk about that. I know don't, Joyce. Don't go there. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive. Is she the one with the black hair? Not today. And this I don't was know. the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? Yeah. It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. 
Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Jeez. No one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure. Run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. The fuck? I do need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. But again, if I recall, there's a password that I don't know. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Hmm. I've already been here. Just TV and Nothing cameras. Nothing in it. It's a padlock. Gun rack. Just tools. This book. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Hmm. Coming back home. Oh. Sure. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Hmm. Up there? Oh, shit balls. Damn. Nope. Nothing Why does he to have see food here. in here? Shouldn't that be in the kitchen? Not in a fucking garage. David has been dragging his head around since two thousand and one. Damn. Oh, is that like another password? Personal single shadow or 2000. No, that's why he's worst wrong. hacker ever. You're not even no hacking. Way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. A tape. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Hmm. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Um, that might be the password, probably. Personal. No, wait. Fam. Uh, yes? <sighs> Try again. Locked out. Okay. So it's not that. Hmm, sun visor? Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. The car year? Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Ooh, this bag. That's cute. Could be a password here. To a real hero. Oh, sir. Survey company? Uh, survey? I don't know. This might arm me. Ah. Such wrong. Damn it. Um. Uh, how the hell? Padlock. Naturally, David would buy a heavy duty military padlock. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Hmm. Oh, I, uh, I guess it would be personal. Seven one seven one. Nope. Come back to the top. Seemed too easy. Okay. Um. Padlock. Chloe can't get another gun now. Unless she steals it back from Frank, oh. yeah. Maybe this ID number might work. Just check this other one just in case. I could try the license number for the password. Alright, now we have two numbers. Personal. 
Magic 8-Ball says no. No way, Max. Damn, all right. Back to family. No, it would be army. Oh, shit balls. Damn Damn it. Uh, um, plate, knife. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. To my field angel. Keep your wings up. Alright. No, that would be army, wouldn't it? Worst hacker. Hmm, that one seemed emotional, but apparently. Uh, it wasn't that. Anything else? In the car at all? I check the thing. This? No figures. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. That might be a useful password. Oh, wait. This, oh, oops. This finally might be it. Family, please. Yes! Score! Max the Hacker strikes again. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? All right. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. This is so wrong. Ugh. Oh, creepy bastard. So she has everything. He has everything on me. I better tell Chloe about this now. Oh, it's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. Best to keep it locked, you know? Alright. Alright, where is she? Ooh, awkward. <laughs> Fuck. Nice breakfast. David, you you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. Hmm. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. <sighs> Fuck. 
figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras, so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just oh. always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. She used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Fuck! Another one? Um... I gotta back. I gotta back it. I can't. I You're can't. a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Uh. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I oh, find I this very disturbing. Spilled the beans. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm outflanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. Wow, maybe... I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Well... Uh... I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Yeah, I figured she wouldn't hate me. <sighs> Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Fuck. Uh, I regret it. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. Right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? Yeah. What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything. For his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. What is he eating? I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Fuck. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... I'll figure it Chloe, out. Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Mm. Fires. Oh, whoops. Look oh. at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Hmm, Fwaka. What do you got to say? Hey, how's it going? What do you have Peachy. to say? Yep. Interview over. Best bad day? Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. 
Time is money to a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, and a slut trying to commit suicide. Maybe what? you should leave then. What if I could? Now even that shifty Rachel What's-Her-Face asked me once if I'd drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Oh. Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Oh, alright, let's rewind this. It's a total douche. Peachy. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the yeah. hell did you know that? I know cars. I, I took a Blackwell class on the history of truckers. I always wanted to drive a rig on the road. Finally, a Blackwell student with brains. Yeah. Next time I get a local job, I'll let you ride along. Take care. <laughs> Feels like snooty. Pete. Um. Yeah. Rachel Amber. My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town. Oh, what the heck? I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those you know who know what's. Good riddance. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Oh, here. Take care. It's weird. Take pictures of my truck anytime. Asshole. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Ugh, but I need to get uh, those keys from Frank. Give me a minute. Okay. Um. What were we doing? All right. Bitch. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. Hmm. Spill. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those bees! <laughs> Bitch. He might have dropped them. No, but what makes you say that he won't just get the keys again? Hmm. Cop. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. Yeah, Nathan. Oh lord. Let's stay away from Prescott. Cage should have. Wow. You should have jumped, asswipe. Kate Marsh, love you a long time. What the fuck? Seventh sign. The sea and the sky will turn black and living things die because of... Huh. Shit. What are the other signs then? Rachel A owes me a BJ. So does your mom. Weird. Arcadia Gay sex deck. <laughs> That's a hand. You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel 
doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Oh, let's do Nathan, because I want to get this asshole. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look, Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Yeah, yeah, yeah you asshole. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Uh. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. Is that actual television? I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Mm. David. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, and then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. What can I do for you, Max? Uh, Kate Marsh. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. And you for helping her. That's the kind of school spirit we need more of. Nathan Prescott. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. Interesting. We'll chat later, Max. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. Oh. I guess I already know that. Okay. Well, now I know that. Uh, oh, Prescott deal. Well... I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Mm. What can I do for you, Max? Weird do town. you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. Makes me sick thinking about it. Alright, let's leave. Talk to Nathan Prescouty. Holy shit, what do you want now? Uh. Ooh. Your father. Your sugar daddy will always protect you and threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Maybe I could help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face. Eh. Mm, 
Holy sh I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig <laughs> over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Hmm, <sighs> he really oh. likes to spill the beans. I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. Asshole. Holy sh... I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit. My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. What? Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Blood oath? What the hell is this turning into? What can I do for you, Max? Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. Now, to his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? Hmm. I don't understand. Is that... But Monty, that doesn't explain the recent extreme weather patterns. No, but we have to start with the hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather. That doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Dr. Hedora, will your team know more after their latest tests? I hope we see more patterns, which gives us an atmospheric template. Many local residents of Arcadia Bay have been questioning oh, what has been going so on boring. with this crazy weather. <laughs> Just she like real TV. A snowstorm two days ago, which, as most of you know, is not common this time of year. It's unprecedented, to be honest with you. Uh, the last time that we had a snowstorm of this caliber was over a hundred years ago. All of us are questioning what is happening in Arcadia Bay. Please feel free to call in and let me know what your experience has been. What you think this might be? Is this global warming? What is causing all of this crazy weather? Ugh. TV. <clears throat> what the fuck now? Everyone has a potty mouth. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother, but I don't need <laughs> your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Uh, buy drugs. Yeah. By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Do you want the after school special to go with that? <laughs> Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. I'll back off. Oh. Get a new outfit. And leave me alone. So... I don't understand. Does he not sell drugs? What the f... Hmm... Save dog. You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. 
To who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. <clears throat> Look at that. My work here is done here, Frank. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. Nope. Appreciate Keep the rock. keys. Now back to Chloe. Easier said. No. Wait. God damn it. I suck English. Are you shitting me? Always has the worst of luck. Move out of the way. Alyssa, watch out! Quick thinking, Max. She will be an import important asset in the future. I can already tell. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. Oh, Lord. All right, here we go. On your mark, get set. Throw. Go towards the road. Parking lot. You kidding? It's a treat, treat boy. I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. Are you fucking serious? Why did I throw the bone at the yard? The doggy is busy now, yard. but he might come back. Oh no, no! Fuck you, man. I ain't killing a dog. Damn, I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you dare me to drive it like you dared me to kiss you? Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. Hmm. Right. Let's see. What can we find here? You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. High five. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. What? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Is that a gun? That's a no. pretty extreme lighter. It's a book. Photo. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Hmm. Apparently a nice TV. Secret ventilation okay, shaft. this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Ooh, Frank's stash. Hmm. Okay. No more secrets. What else is there? Wash stand, a knife. This is almost as good as a set of keys. My blade go. will open any portal. Money? No. It's a notebook. Oh, 
Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. Oh wow. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Me, hope you read this first thing in the morning. So everybody wants to watch a bit. Blah blah blah. I love you. All right. Oh wow. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Hmm. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. <laughs> hmm. Trouble in paradise. You don't blame me for the drugs. Blah, 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 blah. Hmm. 2013. Let's uh, rewind to where that was it. Oh. Here you go. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years, my mother gloms on a step fucker, now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Hey, what the fuck, man? What? Well, hmm. <coughs> Thought I could have rewind and got the keys before she tossed them. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. So now it's Rachel's fault too? Jesus, she was banging that pig, Frank! Bitch lied to my face, Max! I can't trust anybody again. Everybody pretends to care until they don't. Even you. Chloe Ooh. Price. You better take that back. Right now. Okay. Fine. But you just don't understand. It's like I'm being punished by the universe. So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? David? You blame David? I said my dad. Oh. My real father who got himself killed for nothing. Not the human placeholder for Joyce. Chloe. Your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Dude, please stop. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. Oh uh, god, that got a lot more emotional than I needed it to be. <laughs> Just go ahead and, uh, yeah.
And I look innocent as hell. Oh. Oh my god. What the hell was that? What is happening now? What the fuck was that? Don't tell me I can now enter photos. Focus with the A, D, keys, then with the, oh, I'm trying to get into focus. Um, okay, that's out of focus. Uh, oh, I see that's uh, that's out of focus. Oh. No way! What Someday the Dad'll get one of them newfangled computers. Oh, that. I hope the flash didn't scare that's you. That's Max. Max. That's Chloe. What? The... This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey, you look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh. I just. Uh. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is here. Hands, Daddy. Yes, and we can't. Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that far back in time? You mean pancakes? Uh, in France, they call them. Crepes. I'm 18 uh, years old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. Breakfast. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. No way. You remember this... how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare. I love chef. William like, like he was in my like own family. I won't I let him die today. I am. When your mom's I, away. Chloe is just so damn happy and carefree. And this is the last time, unless I change it. Can I really stop? Whoa, it's all blurry here. Like I can't step out of the photographic bounds. Hmm. Then that, on that, I still have my, my my time thing. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. This We're is going she, to work at the Two Whales. This is where she goes. Out, where he goes out, right? What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You're ridiculous. <laughs> He'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Hmm. Hey, Anamu. Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. I need to wait till he finds them keys. Aha! You can't hide from me? Aha! You can't hide from me forever! Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me! That makes all of us. Oh, God. Now is the time. Hurry, hurry. 
hurry, hurry. Careful, Max. William can totally see you. Score! <sighs> Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! What is this? Man, I remember Chloe reading this. But not after today. Step, step, oh. Max, this is not the best time for a prank. Keys, please. Uh, I was just, um, are you sure Joyce is ready? Uh, let's just, let's just wait. I, um, uh, sorry. Here. I'll get you back someday. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make. Okay. Hmm. Shit, ah. where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! I knew this thing would come in handy. How the hell did my keys end up here? Wow. No so he has a little alarm. I'd have to hide it somewhere where it wouldn't make noise. Crap. I need to hide the keys where William won't hear his Another dumb beeper. You're bankrupting me. <laughs> yeah. Eh? Ah. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. I just got the stall for like a forgot all about you, minutes. little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and joys and groceries and... and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Oh, did I really... Did I really fix it? Max, you are being so fucking strange. Whoa. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Did I... Did I really change time? No fucking way. No way. I can do that now? Whoa. No way. <laughs> I don't know what to say. This is. This is just a new. It's enough that I can go back. But. Uh, what the fuck? I'm not paying $150 for a concert. I heard that the Vortex Club parties are wild. Dude, the service fee is like 50%. Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? Uh, All my friends in LA told me what? that Oregon was happening. cold every day. But Never, like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so hard. I know. Sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke them peace pipe? I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Oh, uh, no. Nah. Is 
this is bad. Oh no, Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe. David? What the fuck is going on? You know, I was already confused. Now they're just fucking my brain up. I don't even know what to say. I I actually change time, you know? I stop her dad from dying. What the fuck was the point of all the things I've done in the other thing then? Is that a whale? Oh no. Don't tell me the episode's gonna end. <coughs> oh. No one lives there, huh? Wait. Max Caulfield. Taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. What? I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe! You have a visitor! Is she gonna hate me for this? Fucking speech. What? I don't even know what to say. I mean, I didn't really get many answers. To be honest, barely actually. Um, it was just mostly me fucking around investigating Frank a little bit. And the <laughs> what the fuck? What happened to Chloe? What happened to? Max, where the fuck should she go? What the? F where the fuck is Rachel Amber? I'm gonna go ahead and skip that part since we've already. No. What the fuck? 
What the fuck? The f I don't. I don't even. Was this the episode where I got into the computer? Yes. Yes, it was. Um. Oh. A dark room. Oh. Is this gonna be in like the world of like where we changed it? Oh no. Oh god. I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> My brain is in complete confusion. What happened to Chloe? What the hell? What the hell? Um. Fuck. <laughs> um. I I guess I'm just gonna end it here. I I don't know what to say. I honestly fucking. Um. <laughs> if you enjoyed this, like comment and subscribe and I'll see you later. I'm like a whore, man. I don't know any co-op Uh... Uh, no. Well, this might be...